What's up guys, Mike16 here and welcome back to The Walking Dead game. Uh, today we're starting season 2. No, episode 2 of The Walking Dead series. And I am I am very excited for this because like, you know, I've been waiting for this. So, let's get started. Like the... On the Walking Dead. Oh, well, they're going to tell us. I know who you are. So, what's out? This other time. You've been all by yourself through this? Yeah, I want my parents to come home now. And you, you keep an eye on that front door. You're our lookout. It's Doug. You got it. And I'm Carly. You'll shift in with Doug when he needs it. You got it, boss. One of them is bitten. We kick his ass. That's what I'm thinking. Oh my God. And I don't give a shit about what happens to you. But if anything happens to my daughter or that little girl you've got with you, you watch your ass. All right. Well, that was a nice recap. Now we're staying at the motel, I'm pretty sure. Oh crap, three months later, jeez. <laughs> That's a lady's a long time, man. What was he eating? Who the heck? Damn. What'd they get this time? Who is that? Uh, looks like a rabbit. <sighs> well, that's another meal lost. <sighs> I still can't believe we went through all that commissary food in three months. It seemed like so much at the time. Maybe you shouldn't have opened the door. Yeah, except then I'd probably be food by now. Trust me. I have no regrets. Uh, rabbit's hardly a meal, Martha. I'd take it. We're all hungry. No kidding. Who is that? Well, I know his name's Mark, but... When I accidentally grabbed for Carly's rations the other night, I thought she was gonna take off my hand. We're all on edge. Just cut us some slack. Yeah, you're right. I wish I knew for sure how much food we have left. We'll manage. Maybe. You know, some people aren't too happy about the way Lily's handling rations. Lily knows it's important to keep the adults fed and functioning. Sometimes that means someone's got to miss a meal. You think Kenny's having any more luck than we are out here? I sure hope so. Yeah, between the lack of food and Kenny and Lily fighting all the time, things are getting pretty tense back at the motor inn. You know, Kenny's been talking about taking off if he can get that RV running. Kenny won't abandon us. He's a good man. Well, I guess we'll see. Can't blame him, though. Did you hear Larry going off on him last <coughs> night? What's the old guy's deal, anyway? Seems like he's got a problem with you in particular. He thinks I'm a danger to the group, and Clementine. I think he's the one putting us in danger. The way Lily worries about his health, I wouldn't be surprised if she's been skimming rations for him. And I know Lily thinks he's getting weaker, but the guy's all muscle. He's a walking pile driver. I know I wouldn't want to be stuck in a room with him. And didn't he punch you in the face one time? Uh, knock me flat. You can't miss it. You can't miss it, dude. It's a long shot. I'd hate to waste the bullets. Trust me. If I don't think I can hit it, I won't shoot. Wow. Shit! Was that Kenny? I don't know. Come on! No, please don't tell me Kenny gets you. Jesus Christ. 
Christ. Oh, shit. No, no. Please don't kill us. We just want to help our teacher. We'll leave, I swear. Lee, you guys okay? Get, get it off. Get it off. Damn it. Get, get it off me. Travis, maybe they can help. These might be the same guys that raided our camp, and we barely got away from that. What guys? Why the f*** is there a bear trap out here? It's okay. We're not gonna <coughs> hurt you. Don't listen to them, Ben. Please, just let us go. We're not a threat to you. Kid, chill out. We'll try to help you, but you gotta shut the Please. <laughs> gotta help you. Please. Ben, shut up. My dad was special forces. I know what I'm doing. Just see if you can get him out. Okay. After that, you can leave us or whatever. I don't care. Please. We gotta get him out of there. Oh, God, thank you. Fine, but you gotta hurry. Hurry, please, hurry. Nice. Lee, this trap has been altered. There's no release latch. Oh, no. Shit, walkers. It's now or never, Lee. Please, get me out of this. Mark, get the boys back. Kenny, keep those walkers off of me. Please hurry. Okay. You have to get him out. Stop you have to do something. Please, get me. Is he? Is he gonna make it? No, no, no! Stop! There has to be a way oh, out of this. Jane. Oh no! Do we have to? How would somebody do this? Really, Just get me out, please. Let's go! Let's All go! That blood screaming. We're gonna be Why surrounded any minute. Hurry! Uh -huh. It has to be now. If you don't like violence, don't look. Like to get you out. Don't look. No, no, no! Try the trap again. Anything, please. Damn it, he just cut off his leg. Uh, I'm sorry, but we have to go uh, now. Uh, 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 don't look at him. Uh, I can't oh. keep him back forever. One more hit for me. Passed out. Okay, he passed out. Get him. Quick. If he's alive, grab him and let's go. Go, 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 go. Behind you! Travis! Come on, come on, we gotta move! Dude, just... Oh yeah, thank you Xbox. Going hungry. This is fortified pretty well. They got barbed wire and everything. Get the gates open! We've got wounded! Shit! What the hell are they doing? Time to explain. Lee, are you okay? Get him into the truck. I'll see what I can do. Cat, okay? Can you fix him? Jesus, Ken. Lee. I, I don't know. Lee. Can you fix him? What the hell? You can't just be bringing new people here. What are you thinking? Hey, you want to calm down for a fucking hey, minute? What no, you want? I don't. I, love Larry. I want to know why you thought bringing more no, mouths to feed was a good him. idea. He would have died if we left him. So what? We are not wow. responsible for every struggling survivor we come across. We have to focus on our group. 
right here, right now. Well, hang on. We haven't even talked to these people yet. Maybe they can be helpful. Come on, Lily. These are people. People trying to survive just like us. We've got to stick together to survive. The only reason you're here is because you had food. Enough for all of us. But that food is almost gone. We've got maybe a week's worth left. Okay. And I don't suppose you guys are carrying any groceries, are you? That's what um, you're okay. No? Fine. You guys fight it out then. <laughs> Welcome to the family. Come over here and see what I drew. But what? No, I... <laughs> Just come on, okay? You know, you like to think you're the leader of this little group, but we can make our own goddamn decisions. This isn't your own personal dictatorship. Oh, okay. come on, you're being dramatic. Everything always turns into a power struggle between you two. I'm not going to be a part of that. Hey, no, you know I didn't ask to lead this group. Everyone was happy to have me distributing the food when there was enough to go around. But now that it's running out, suddenly I'm a damn Nazi. It doesn't matter who's in charge. Those people are here now. I guess we just have to decide what happens no, next. No, Lee, it does matter. Hmm. One person can't be in charge of everything. You know, it might feel safe for you to sit on the fence. But sooner or later, you're going to have to decide whose side you're on. I don't see any of you stepping up to make the hard decisions. My girl's got more balls than all of you combined. Dad, please. Why don't you go help Mark with the wall? Yeah, Larry. Piece of crap. Let's go have a heart attack or something. You think this is easy for me? Everyone's starting to hate me because I'm the one that rations the food. But nobody else wants to. You know what? I'm not doing it tonight. Today's food rations, but there's not enough for everyone. Good luck. Four for ten. Wow, they're all looking at us. Okay. <laughs> I love that bumper sticker, dude. Alright. Let's get to a dead guy. I, I know who I'm giving. We're gonna go over here. We're gonna give Kenny one first. How you doing, Clementine? Okay. Where's your hat? I don't know. Can you help me find it? Sorry, honey, I don't have time. That was my favorite hat. I promise. If I find it, I'll let you know. Thank you. Okay, Clem. I've got to take care of some things. Why don't you go back to playing with Duck for a while? Okay. I love Lee, dude. Lee is so cool. Alright, we're gonna give Kenny. I'm gonna give Kenny food. Want something to eat? He's a jerk. He's a Here, man. Kenny, take this. How about my boy? He eat yet? Uh, no. Come talk to me once my boy's taken care of. All right. All right. All right. I respect that. I respect that. Here, you go, duck. Hey, duck. How about a little food? God, I freaking hate that face, dude. Stop. Here. Yeah. Oh man, I'm so hungry. Alright, I'll just go give Kenny some jerky. And then I'll give. Want something to eat? Want something to eat? Beef jerky. Here, Kenny, take this. How about he's my boy? Because he's a he man. Yet? Yeah, I gave him something. Sure, then hand it over. I'm starved. Thanks. Love Kenny, man. He was starved, and he was making sure that his son was taken care of first. I'm gonna give Want something to eat? give her an apple. Have an apple, Carmen. God, I used to eat an apple every morning with some granola and six almonds, and that wasn't enough even then. But you know what? Yes. You're welcome. Keep the last piece. I'm gonna oh, save it for some somebody of these else. people have gone longer than me without food. Mm -hmm. They're the ones that need it. Yeah, that's true. Clementine's fine. She's fine. She's tough. 
Hold on, Gabe. Will you hold the damn board steady? I'm trying. I, I didn't realize I was getting this weak already. What do you want? A handout? <laughs> oh, I got 60 cents in my pocket. If you'll shut up and quit being such a pansy. <sighs> Here, Larry. Lily would want you to keep your strength up. That girl needs to quit worrying about me so much. Oh, man. Just seeing the food is driving me crazy. Need any help with the wall? Nope. Actually, we could use your axe. Do you mind if we take it? Yeah, give us that thing for a bit. Hmm. I gave food to Larry. I gave Thanks. Larry hey, the food. Hey, I'm the one doing all the work over here. You didn't think to give me the axe? I give you food. Come on, Larry, give it a rest. I'm sure Lee is getting pretty sick of you thinking he's a danger to the group. Is that what you told him? There, that's right. Yeah, and what are you to gonna me. do about it? Look, I don't care what it is, but you two have got to start trying to get along. The only thing I have to do is protect my daughter. And right now, that means getting this damn wall fixed. So I would appreciate it if you two would shut up and let me get back to work. Hmm. I wonder if, like, I haven't seen his wife. Larry's wife. I wonder what happened to her. Not such an easy job, is it? I hope I get to eat next time. Oh, you piece of crap. I don't envy you. I don't know how you have the strength to do this every day. I don't have a choice. Lee. Yeah. Kitty, I know I ran out of food before. Hey, you took care of my boy. As far as I'm concerned, you did right by me. Still, I guess some people aren't going to be happy with your choices. Ken, Lee, come here, please. He didn't make it, did he? He lost too much blood. God damn it. I'm getting sick of this shit. Ken, come back. There's nothing... Let him go, Kaja. But... He just needs time. It's been a rough morning. That man you brought, I tried. But he was never going to survive. Well, at least he's not our problem anymore. More food for us. No, 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 no. Oh, oh, oh. No, no, no. Q, 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 Q. Q, 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 You okay? Yeah. Thanks. It's gonna draw some attention though. Why'd you bring him here in the first place, asshole? Dad, calm down. You're gonna get us all killed. Why didn't you tell us he was bitten? What? He was bitten, and you didn't say a word. Oh. But he wasn't bitten, I swear. Well, your not right. bitten friend here came back to life and tried to kill my wife. What? Wait, you all don't know? What the hell are you talking about? It's not the bite that does it. Hmm. You come back no matter how you die. If you don't destroy the brain, that's just what happens. It's going to happen to all of us. Oh. We're all infected? Everyone? I, I guess so. I don't know. I, all I know is that I've seen people turn who I know were never bitten. When I first saw it happen, we were all hiding out in a gym and everybody thought we were finally safe. But one of the girls, Jenny Pitcher, I think, I guess she couldn't take it. She took some pills. A lot of them. 
Someone went in the girls' room the next morning and... God. Back mm. off! Whoa, lady, relax. Me and my brother, we, we just want to know if y'all can help us out. I said back off! Carly. We don't want any trouble. Of course, uh, n neither do we. Uh, I'm Andy St. John. This here's my brother Dan. We're just out looking for gasoline. Looks like you folks got the motel locked down, which, which is fine, but uh, if you could spare any gas, well, we'd be much obliged. Why do you need gas? Our place is protected by an electric fence. Generators provide the electricity. Our generators run on gas. Look, we own a dairy farm a few miles up the road. If y'all be willing to lower your guns, we, we can talk about some kind of trade. How y'all doing on food? We got plenty at the dairy. Hmm. Lee, why don't you and Mark check the place out? See if it's legit. I'm going with you. I got your back if anything seems fishy. Yeah. So, uh, what do y'all think? You've got a deal. We'll bring some gas to your dairy. In exchange, you give us some food to bring back. We'll see how it goes from there. Sounds fair. A couple gallons should power one of our generators for a while. So... Alright, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed the first part of episode 2. It's getting confusing. Love y'all, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.